Go, Rachel! Go, Rachel! Rachel Olson, also a competitive cyclist. She's on the Okay, so you're Rachel Olson, and you won the Buffalo Springs Lake 70.3 race this year. How does it feel to win after getting second last year? Um, it's awesome. Definitely a redemption factor. Um, I knew I was a lot stronger this year, and knowing that that hard work definitely paid off was a great feeling. <laughs> So you cut, uh, I think, was it like 13 minutes off your time from last year? That's a bit. Is that like the big? Have you ever made that big of a jump in an Ironman 70.3 time? Um, I would have at Gulf Coast if we had the swim portion, um, but I didn't really count that as kind of the time jump. So this is, yeah, probably the biggest gap. So you did. You already had a slot to Chattanooga before you came here. Where did you get that from? Um, I got it at Tempe, uh, the Arizona 70.3 last year, last October. Oh wow! So you've had that a long time. Yeah, so you, I wanted to. That. I knew that it would be kind of tight to get it, so I wanted to go ahead and get so it. So you right mentioned away. <laughs> you mentioned with Mike Riley that you, you're going to specialize in the 70.3 for a while. Yes, uh, I like the short distance. I'm a little bit younger, so I, I don't feel the need no, to jump to the 140.6 yet. <laughs> so obviously, one of the things that's happened. Between last year and, I mean, last year when you did this race, Siri Lindry wasn't your coach yet, right? Nope, Siri wasn't my coach. We started in December of last year. And so, what do you think, obviously, whatever she's doing is working. You've already got a slot and you've come in one here. So, what is the best thing that she, in the three sports, which one is she helping the most and, and why? why is that? I would say she's really actually helping in the fourth sport of my mental attitudes. Um... I had just kind of been going through the motions. I knew I was, you know, pretty good, and but I just wasn't taking that next step. She brought in a whole new factor of uh, my passion and happiness back into the sport. So that has fueled all three sports. Um, but my run, she's definitely, I've definitely stepped back up to where I was in the run previously. Do you feel like that the, the fact that she was a great runner that 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 does that inspire you? Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's just been. She just knows how to push me the right way. So. so, one other thing that's happened since the last time we spoke to you is that your Cobb Cycling, your employer and one of your sponsors, who also are good, John Cobb is also good friends with Siri Lindley. And because um, I met John and Siri in Kona, actually, we were eating at the same Thai restaurant. Um, how, how has that corporate buyout and your like work life how's your work life jibing with your new fo more focused coached focus on triathlon how how's the buyout and your corporate life change affected your racing life um it's actually very similar to what it was you know don really wanted to keep the same atmosphere that we had before so 